Right, welcome back to episode 2 of Maneater. Uh, sorry for the abrupt ending yesterday, but the, the fam came home uh, from their uh, daily exercise whilst I was in bed. Uh, and uh, they were out for a few hours and came back, obviously, at the time they did. So I didn't think it was wise to continue the recording, but hey-o, we're back now. Um, I don't know where it's going to kick us out at. Yeah, there we go, 20 minutes on the dot, look at that. Hopefully it continues us after, uh, you know, the, the mission. I really don't want to be dealing with those alligators again. A peculiar biological adaptation oh. allows the bull to survive in fresh water. Oh, hang on. Alright, there's the log. Ah, yes, there we go. Okay. Let's track it. Let's track it. is a freshwater fish commonly found throughout the Great Lakes region, so I have no idea what it's doing here. Those new pop-up tough stoppers at home. 
Let me tell you, those things are just a magnet for hair and debris. The solitary hunter stumbles upon another source of nourishment. The shark uses lipids from high-fat fare like this to help fuel her reign of terror. Eater's longevity depends on her nimbleness. Someone should have taken a gun safety class. Is it 
grotto. Is this the grotto? would hardly be the strangest thing ever retrieved from a crocodile's mouth. And poor decision making. Lovely. Oh, look at him go. Look at him, beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Oh, the speed difference already. Insane. And yes. Boom. Um, what 
do I need to go? All the way over there! Damn! Okay, come around here. There's walls though. A catfish is easily distinguished from other species by their smooth, scaleless bodies and signature whiskers. Okay, well, I ain't going there yet. Let's go to the log. Okay, there's a lot about this. <laughs> There's a lot about this, is it? Am I missing something? I, I keep missing what is the actual... What is this? Hunt. Maybe I'll just... No, I don't want to do that one. Yeah, I know that. I've visited that. Yes. Well, let me just... Let's track that for now. Unless I have to go this way, actually. That... that makes sense. That's a long-ass swim, though. Damn! Oh, no, look, there's another... There's another wall. There is another wall. What's this one? That's what's the crocodilio. See you later, alligator. Oh, the landmarks. Okay. Let's just go. Let's go. Over the course of a bull shark's life, it will ingest quite a broad assortment of flotsam and jetsam. As a result Boom. Oh, of industrial pollution and sewage wastewater, Dead Horse Lake was designated a Superfund site in 1996. spent 16 years building this sculpture out of trash pulled from the lake, only to have it thrown back in the lake by intoxicated <laughs> locals. Oh, wow. 16 
is. of the grotto enables the shark to approach the world with greater confidence and effectiveness. Fascinating, if not slightly more than expected.
is a great opportunity for the shark to test the theory that exposure to gamma rays gives you superpowers.